a jury in Massachusetts found a Southern California man guilty of arranging fake marriages to help foreigners get United States citizenship. The man conspired with others in a large-scale fraud scheme that matched hundreds of non-citizens with Americans to marry in exchange for expensive fees, News.com has learned. And Gilbert Ulan, 42, was convicted on Thursday, November 30th, for his role in arranging more than 300 fake marriages to help foreigners circumvent immigration laws. Ulan, originally from the Philippines, worked at an agency that operated out of Los Angeles, according to the U.S. Attorney's Office in the District of Massachusetts, where at least one of the foreign nationals he arranged marriages for was from. The group not only set up the sham marriages, but also filled out paperwork and created fraudulent documents for its clients, federal prosecutors said. Once the couples were paired up, the agency even staged fake wedding ceremonies at chapels and parks. For many clients, the agency would take photos of undocumented clients and citizen spouses in front of prop wedding decorations for later submission with immigration petitions, the U.S. Attorney's Office said. Ulan also coached clients in preparation for interviews with immigration authorities and fed them fabricated answers to questions he knew would be asked, according to officials. These services, in total, cost customers between $20,000 and $30,000 in cash, the U.S. Attorney's Office. In 2022, the U.S. Attorney at the time, Rachel Rollins, estimated the operation brought in at least $8 million, according to the Boston Herald. A large chunk of these profits, the newspaper reported, went to the fake spouses, who had to keep up appearances of married life throughout the process. Investigators learned Ulan participated in the scheme between December 2019 and March 2022, during which time he received commissions for referring new clients to the agency. He also let clients list his apartment's address as their own on green card applications, according to the U.S. Attorney's Office. Ulan was convicted of conspiracy to commit marriage fraud and immigration document fraud, and was one of 10 defendants convicted in connection to the marriage scheme. Nine others have pleaded guilty to the charges against them. Ulan is scheduled to be sentenced on March 6, 2024. His charges carry a maximum sentence of up to five years in prison, three years of supervised release and a fine of $250,000.